All right, got a great video today. I just got in my Black Friday shipment uh, about a week ago or so. I've had this bar sitting, waiting to be opened. I've opened everything else, but I wanted to do this on video. So here it is. I'm gonna go ahead and show you. This is, I assume it's what I think it is. I think it's a camo Cerakote Rogue Ohio bar. We'll see. I'm pretty excited about this. I've seen it on the internet quite a bit and I wanted to see it in person. Let's do it. Okay, it's in the beautiful Rogue packaging. This one actually came already open so I could tell kind of what it was. Now this is the Cerakote Barbell. I have another Cerakote Barbell from Rogue. I've done a review on it, the red one. I'm a huge fan of Cerakote as a coating, okay? I think it's unbelievable, I think it's great. But they've since come out and they're starting to do some special colorways like an American flag, camo, things like that. Let's open it. Ooh. Now this bar, let's go ahead and do a close up here. As you can see, this one has the Cerakote sleeve coating. Now, to be honest, I prefer the chrome sleeve coating. What I've seen with the Cerakote is, yeah, it holds up okay, um, but the plates, once they go on, they kind of chip it and make it look bad. I'll show you in a second after we open this. Wow. As you can see, this is incredible. Who would have ever thought that a barbell would be coated in camo? So what it looks like is it's got this pattern here, which is similar to what the Rogue is, which is in Cerakote. And then they, they sprayed it multiple times and they've done it on the knurl as well. Now in the middle here, like there's some raised edges, basically on the Rogue logo, because it's thicker. They probably don't want it to chip off and things like that. Like it feels kind of like a sticker, but it's actually paint, you know. It actually is paint. But everywhere else, like here on the knurling, you can't feel any difference. So it's not like gonna affect your grip or anything like that. I mean, this is freaking sweet. If you're a, see this is the thing, if you're a gym owner, a personal training gym owner, commercial gym owner, CrossFit box owner, and you wanna set yourself apart from the competition, getting equipment like this that's fun to train with, looks cool, gets your clients excited about it, this is the kind of stuff you need to invest in. If you look at people like Gunnar Peterson, you know, who has the LA personal training gym, trains all the celebrity athletes, he has all this equipment, he doesn't just have that equipment because it works well. Sure, that's a reason, but it provides variety and getting your clients to constantly have this variety and to come back and get excited about working out, that kind of stuff matters. So, you know, if you're like a CrossFit box owner and you're not like spending money on your clientele and on your equipment, then you need to step your game up. Because service is one thing, but you also have to think service in terms of, you know, the gear you have and things like that matters. For you home gym owners, if you just want a cool barbell like, like, if you really, most people only need one barbell, maybe two, if they want a beater bar as well. If you want a, like a barbell that's gonna perform over the long term, it's gonna have great corrosion resistance, things like that, Cerakote is awesome for that. Not only that, for, you know, just a few bucks more, you can get it in camo. Freaking sick. Okay, now I'm gonna go grab the red Cerakote bar and kinda show you basically what it looks like after you've used it for, you know, a couple months. Okay, so as you can see, this is the red Cerakote bar. Um, this one actually gets used a lot, and the reason it gets used a lot is because I was as I was talking about, everybody that comes to my gym, they say, I wanna use the red barbell, you know, because it's just cool, it's unlike any of the others. As you can see, there's no wear 
like right here there's some chalk but anywhere else there's really no wear so the the shaft of the barbell doesn't receive much wear like it's going to last a long time Cerakote doesn't really wear off if you look at some of the tests they've done comparing it to stainless steel chrome all those things Cerakote outlasts um all those others just a crazy amount okay it's just it's crazy how basically tough and resistance it is, resistant it is. Now, the one issue I have with these Cerakote bars is not the shafts. The issue is on the sleeves. Here, I'll show you. Okay, so this is a brand new sleeve here on the camo bar. This is the new or the old sleeve on the Rogue um, bar. Okay, I prefer a chrome end sleeve because these end up scarring and not looking so hot. So as you can see here, and I've got, I'm using nice plates. It's not like I'm, I'm not throwing like metal plates on this. These are like competition bumpers, you know, nice plates that don't really scar bars very much. So as you can see right here, there's just a lot of wearing and scarring and this has started to kind of fade a little bit. Now we'll see what this looks like more over time, but for now, Although I really like Cerakote for the shaft, I'm not a huge fan of Cerakote for the sleeve and just because it wears in. Okay, this gives you a little bit better view. So you can see the logo, everything like that. I mean, it is beautiful. I'm actually really impressed with the bar. I know they have different colors. They've got a, you know, like a traditional green, you know, drab, olive drab um, camo bar. And then this one, I really like this one. It stood out really well. Um, Cerakote's going to last a long time, so I wouldn't worry about you know this finish like flaking off or anything like that. And if you get this one, if you put chalk on it, like it's already silver anyway, so it's just going to blend in. So I really like the Cerakote bars. I'm a big fan of this. I think this is probably the coolest looking barbell I've ever seen. I hope they continue to do these designs. I know there's some traditionalists out there that are like, you know, it should only be chrome. It should only be silver. All this. Listen. Training is fun, make it fun. I don't see any reason that it shouldn't be. And having tools like this, it's just another thing to add to your arsenal, okay? But this has been Coop with GarageGymReviews.com. Would you use a bar like this? Is this a bar that you would buy? If so, let me know in the comments below. If it's not, let me know, okay? Let me know why. So make sure you subscribe. We'll see you later. Peace.